Sometimes prevention of cancer, or possibly even curing cancer, may be something really simple. Something so simple, it may actually be under our noses, so to say. In this case, for the purple potato, it actually is. Going into the research. Now, before you proceed, proceed forward. Keep in mind, these purple potatoes not only help clear colon cancer stem, uh, colon cancer cells, but also colon cancer stem cells, the root, the cause of the cancer itself. But I digress, Let's move forward. Colorful potatoes may pack powerful cancer prevention punch, citation title. Anthocyanin containing purple flesh potatoes suppress colon cancer, colon, sorry, colon tumorigenesis via elimination of colon cancer stem cells. You heard that right, elimination of colon cancer stem cells. Going into the research, this is the quote from the actual study as we proceed forward. The researchers who released their findings in the Journal of Nutrition, no biochemistry, if I can get that out properly, online, used a baked, keep in mind, this is not a special potato extract. They used a baked purple potato because potatoes are widely consumed. Something easy to access that anybody can get a hold of, generally, in Western countries at least. They wanted to make sure the vegetables maintained their anti-cancer properties even after cooking. And this is what they discovered when they baked the purple potato. Baked purple, uh, baked purple flesh potatoes suppress the growth of colon cancer tumors in petri dishes and in mice by targeting the cancer stem cells, the root of the cancer stem, uh, the cancer itself. It basically helped flush out the cancer stem cells. Pretty amazing for something as simple as a purple potato. Now I proceed forward. Indeed, we have seen that animals who consume purple potatoes, once fortunate enough to eat purple potatoes, are healthier compared to animals that receive the drug treatments. So potatoes, drugs. Well, you can figure the rest out. Purple potatoes could be potentially used, this is their words, not mine in primary and secondary prevention strategies for cancer. Primary prevention is aimed at stopping the initial attack of cancer, while secondary prevention refers to helping patients in remission remain cancer-free, just by eating a purple potato. Now you may ask, say to yourself, how much purple potato is required? Do I have to eat a bunch, six, seven? What is it? This is where it gets really simple. Now keep in mind for those which are concerned about the weight, in carbohydrates, purple potatoes are resistant starches, so they're difficult uh, for the body to uh, break down the starch. So, before I proceed forward, here we go. The portion size for a human would be about the same as eating a medium-sized purple flesh potato for lunch and dinner. So that's two purple potatoes, medium size, or one large purple potato, whatever a large purple potato is, or dinner itself. Now keep in mind, it's a purple potato. We're not talking you know, any other potato, but a purple potato for the study purpose itself. And to basically hypothesize what may be actually having this amazing anti-cancer effect as far as attacking the stem cells and the cancer, uh, other cancer cells itself, this is what the researchers speculate. According to the researchers, there may be several substances in purple potatoes that work simultaneously on multiple pathways to help kill the colon cancer cells. Kind of like overwhelms, attacks it from all angles. These are anthocyanins, chlorogenic acid, and as we mentioned before, the resistant starch, which resistant starch may end up uh, developing or cause more production, what's called butyric acid in the colon itself, which also is a very powerful cancer fighter. Again, something simple, something you can eat on a regular basis, especially if this type of cancer is concerned uh, for you personally, and it's right underneath our noses. Powerful, effective uh, at primary prevention and at secondary, putting a person into remission potentially. Again, this is Ralph Church Channel. I really hope this does help. Thank you very, very much.